you have to also watch Who Killed Sheila. And I was like, bitch, <laughs> you killed her. And she was like, You all, killed Sheila. She was like all fucking inter- being interviewed. And she's like, I don't care. I'm here. We're like, bitch, you killed her. Like, you fucking killed her. Anyways. Okay. Anyways. You feel good? I feel good. Are we are we on? Okay. Hello! Once again, welcome to A Kiki with Disco and Kixie. <laughs> Cheers. 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 We're here, we're queer, and we're drunk. <sighs> we're gonna have some fun and talk some shit. How are you? I'm good, I'm good, I'm good. Yeah. How was your uh, week? The week has been great, and um, I'm just here to do my damn thing. And I want to say thank you to uh, Jasmine Glam for my sweater. She made me look like Pamela Anderson from the '90s. Um, <laughs> yeah, you was... look like you look like Pam Anderson's uh, Baywatch uh, understudy. <laughs> <laughs> the, the it's okay. She got a part. She yeah, got she got a part. part. She got a part. She got a part. But yeah, Jasmine Glam bought me this sweater that says Vixen. I think it was. From... Oh, she bought it. Yeah, she bought That's it for cute. me. She gave it to me. And so thank you, bitch. Thank you, thank you, thank you. But um, yeah, come on over, girl. She come on me over. Shit. Well, she doesn't like you. No. Her mother <laughs> likes me. Oh my god, her mother loves me. I hate almost a her mother. <gasps> Just kidding. But let's talk about hate. <laughs> let's talk about let's talk about what do we you know, so we as um as Queens and as LGBTQ people, we always talk about love and acceptance. Mm. <laughs> but like, let's be real. There's a lot of hate. There is a lot of motherfucking hate. There's a lot of hate. So like, what do you hate lately? What What is something that is just like, oh, this is a good one. Like, what do you, what do I hate lately? Wait, okay, wait, what do you hate lately? Do you like... Um, um well, besides people. No, I actually, I ah! love people. I love people. I love people. But, um... I hate. What do I hate? I hate. Uh, I hate the cops. I hate the police. Yes, we hate the police. <laughs> yes, you police don't do shit. Thank up. you so much for not and doing anything. And stop trying to get into our pride parade, okay? Like, build your own, do your own thing. But I do hate the police. The police can um, eat shit and die. As eat disco sh- once eat said shit about and rich die. people. Yes. Oh, they I can... hate rich people too. Yeah, yeah, rich people. Yeah. Rich people, I hate they're them. They're terrible. Yeah, they're terrible. They're awful, mm-hmm. and they live in a in a world that is not uh, real. And um, yeah, I hate that. What do you hate? You know what I hate? I hate people that um, have dogs and don't clean up uh, their dog shit. <gasps> I yes. hate that. Yes. I hate that. I live. Um, well, you know, we live in Hillcrest, so mm-hmm. they're like the cost here of living in here Diego, in case- is insanely high. So the people here are mostly terrible, and all the heterosexuals are moving in, and they're just destroying everything. And the one, the biggest mm-hmm. thing that I see every single day is that they walk their dogs, and they don't clean up their fucking dogs' shit. There's shit everywhere, everywhere. You know why? Because they're entitled. Yes, they of course they, they are. They don't think that they need to clean up after themselves. It's disgusting. Straight people do better. Do better. Clean up do yourself. Do better. Ugh. So that's what we hate. This I week. hate. I hate <laughs> woo girls. <laughs> do you want to talk about it? Do you want to talk about what? What <laughs> I hate. Like, I hate woo girls so much. <laughs> And I don't know if there are any woo girls that are going to be watching this anytime soon, but if but, there okay, so are... Explain to me what's a woo girl. What's a woo girl? What's this a woo girl? is a woo girl. <laughs> yes, this is a woo girl. So a woo girl is a straight heterosexual... Okay, first of all, I have to. I do have to say, I love my heterosexual allies. Me 100%. Too. The girls and the guys that come to actually support and be an ally and that are part of the community. Yes, we love you, that's great. A woo girl are the straight, heterosexual, terrible girls that come just to get fucked up, puke on the dance floor, scream at people, shove people out of the way, get entitled, and are constantly just screaming. Why do you scream so much? Why do you scream so much? What is that? You're at a bar and you're screaming so much. I live above Inside Out. I don't know if you know this. I live above Inside Out. That is a bar and a, 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 a very, restaurant. A very famous yeah. bar here. Yeah. Constantly, every single day, especially at brunch Saturday and Sunday, 
all I hear through my windows is that one fucking girl. Ah! Me. Yes, constantly. So am I a wow girl? No, or a woo, woo, girl? Woo, woo. No, 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 woo. no. A woo. You're girl. just a mess. I, I am. I am. I'm, <laughs> I'm just a drag queen. You're okay. just a mess. Well, cheers to but, that. Yes, but woo girls, calm down. Yeah, we'd yeah. love to have you in our spaces, but there are spaces. Uh. They're not for you. Uh huh. So don't puke. <gasps> Can I tell you a really disgusting story? Sure. Oh, this is. Oh, this is really disgusting. I'm really scared right now. Okay, so I'm not gonna name the bar. Okay. But I was at, but I was at a bar. At a certain bar. At a certain in bar. In San Diego. Yes, and you know, and you know the bar. It was, let's, let's, oh, let's, hell yeah. yeah. <gasps> so, I, I was at this bar, and I was walking through, and there's all. You were walking and uh, thinking and talking at the same time. Kind right, of right, right, yeah, yeah, yeah. Very I was like, you know, I was walking and um, talking. <laughs> uh, Cause that's what I normally do. Uh, you know, I'm very multi-talented. No, just yeah. walking, talking, thinking, mm -hmm. and I look down, she's multi -talented. and there's there's blood everywhere. <gasps> there's blood everywhere. There is a trail of blood that goes from was the it a murder bar on the dance floor all the way into the bathroom, like a like someone had been murdered, like someone had been stabbed. I panicked because I used to work at this place, so I know everybody. So I go to the bartender. I was like, Oh my god, like something has happened. Is everybody okay? Like. Find security, we need to figure out what's going on, like da 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 da. And nobody was panicking. And so I I I like security came and they were cleaning it up and everything like that. And I talked to somebody else and they were like, it was a heavy flow day. <laughs> I said it was a murder on the dance floor. It was a murder on the dance floor. Why aren't you? First of all, you're at a bar, why aren't you wearing panties? Number two, like if you know you're on a heavy flow day, why aren't you wet? Like, there was blood. It literally looked like someone had chopped their arm off and they were running to the bathroom. It was b b bits of blood plots like this big. Well, it was a murder on the dance floor, honey. Bitch, it was I the dance floor. almost crossed over. Well, I would hope so because it was at disgusting. that point, honey, but with that being said, <laughs> there segue. Are, yeah, there it has now been a multiverse of madness in our uh, bars and clubs um, here in our community, and we welcome everybody. Like, don't get me wrong, I love all of our um, heterosexual everybody. Like, I love, 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 love you. But if you come to our bars and our clubs, and um, especially if you're a woman. Just thought there's gonna be a heavy pour. They're gonna pour for like a man's fucking like. Well, like this alcohol like, that we are used to. Yeah, and and then also um, I've heard of uh, situations where some of the women that bring their straight. Um, oh, they get so mad. Yeah, the straight like so friends mad. or the straight boyfriends, and then you know some gay guy will be like. The guy's hot. I'm gonna go say hi, There's and been then fights. the guy. Yeah, people get pissed off. Yeah, they just run around like crazy. Like, just all remember, I do, all I want to do is suck your dick. Like, yeah. why are you so mad? Like, it's a mouth. We have a great time. Why you but and just remember, you're in our home, and we're welcoming to everybody. But just be nice. Like, just have a good time. Party it up. Get stop smart. screaming. Stop, stop screaming. And um. Just, um, if you're straight, let us, you know, just kind of suck your dick. Ah! That's it. That's, That's all I'm it. saying. And, so, uh, no more murders on the dance floor, okay, bitch? No yeah, more murders. No, so, speaking so of murders on the dance floor. Speaking of murder. I've been watch. so I watch murders, um, Me on, mon on, on Mondays. Mondays. So, okay. yeah, so, so I, okay, so we're gonna talk about murder. Okay, yeah. go. So, on Mondays, um, on my days off, after, like, a long, long, long weekend, of uh, practically murdering my soul uh, for everybody because I love what I do. Keep talking. Go, go, go. Um, I love doing Murder Mystery Mondays. And um, the last one that I watched was um, Mean Girl Murders. Have which, you guys seen this? If you haven't, uh, here it is. Or here it is. Or mean here Girl it Murders. Is. Mean Girl Murders, which means it's 
pretty much like Mean Girls, but they take it to the fucking extreme where somebody oh ends up God. getting like murdered. All these fucking like high schoolers, middle schoolers, mm -hmm. I see like getting like all these Mean Girl preppy girls, and they always call it the preppy girls. Like yeah, oh my God, and they like totally wore like Abercrombie and Fetch and Aeropostale. When I heard Aeropostale, I was like, <gasps> okay, if that's what you okay, so back then, but it's fine. And they drove Volvos, and it was just. Get it was crazy, but, but then they talk. like murdered everybody. Okay, okay, yeah, but real talk. Yeah, would you ever murder somebody here? You know what? When we were talking, when we were talking about this, is the the uh, topic that we were to talk about. I was like, I gotta ask her. Is there anybody that she would like to murder? <laughs> um, it's not just one body. I Maybe like two or three or four or five or six or seven or eight or nine or ten. I don't know that I would. No, I would. I don't I would. know that I would. No, I would personally murder. I would. You know what I would do? I would do this like joke, almost like. I, I'm going to pretend that I'm going to murder you and I would go through the whole thing up to the last point to be like, tell the fucking truth. How would you murder somebody? How um, would you murder somebody and get away with it? Oh, shit. I, oh, I love it that we both crossed our legs. Like, this is like a <laughs> you can't see this right now, but because I that. know how I would murder somebody. Okay. How would you murder somebody? How would I murder somebody? Oh, fuck. I feel like if this if something happens to someone, they're going to come after me thinking I did something. Okay, how would I murder somebody? Okay, well... I know what to put in somebody's drink and then wait for them to be in like a dark, dark place. Mm -hmm. And then just be like, oh, I got you, I'll help you. And then throw them in a wood chipper? No, and I'll be like, here. Oh. <laughs> well, oh. yeah. Well, Sorry. No, no, because I've seen enough where like, if they find the smallest little nail in- <gasps> And that was part, of, okay, bitch. we're gonna talk about something. Yeah, that, yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, no, bitch, you can't get away with that. So what I would do, I would actually, um, cause I live in San Diego. Um, I would, and I hate the sea. I really do hate the ocean. Like I hate the ocean like a lot. Like I really do because the water just scares me. Um, cheers to that. You won't see me in the Sharks ocean. scare me. Unless I'm going to murder somebody. So speaking of sharks, I would take the body after like I would drug them. Mm -hmm. And then, um, I would probably like slit their throat just so they could get enough blood out. <laughs> it doesn't look like this at all. And then I would, I'd be like, I'm gonna take this little boat. And, what the fuck? I would take this little boat <laughs> out into the sea. And then I'd be like, oh, hey, sharkies, where are you? I got food for you. Bitch. I... Is that what you would do? Is that what you would do? Okay, so this is how I would How would you do it? Okay, so did I think I, about that a lot? I, I think I thought about that a lot. I like, thought about like, it a lot. Oh, yeah. Okay, so I would... Okay, so I uh, lived in Florida for a few years, like four years. And my family lives in Florida still, some of them, uh, in northern Florida. But it's still... It, so Florida's very swampy, if you don't know. Uh, there's a lot <laughs> alligators. of alligators. Ah! Yes. I know where you're um, going. There's a lot of, like, the Everglades and all that kind of stuff. So, what I would do is I would take this person and be like... Hey, oh my god, we should totally Why go on looking at me We right should now. totally go on vacation together. Wow. I think it'd be so much fun. Like I've been I have this great town. Like, oh my god, it'd be so nice. Like, let's go to like I don't know, St. Augustine. That's nice. Or um, we can go to like um Okeechobee Lake. That sounds nice. And we would cabin and everything would be great and it would be fun. And I would uh totally fucking Why drug. are you brushing my hair right now, bitch? Saying, like, <laughs> oh, in case anybody ends up gone. Yeah. Bitch, fuck uh, you. And I would totally <laughs> and I would and I would drug you. Uh, <laughs> and then I would I would wrap your body in gauze. Uh but what's not, the gauze? Like gauze something that's like uh like breathable. Gauzy? Like something that's breathable, not plastic. Not plastic, because the alligators need to smell you. So I would wrap you in something breathable and then, and duct tape, and then I would take you out to the Everglades in the middle of fucking nowhere and I would drop you off because nobody would ever fucking find you. Because not only do they have a uh, alligators, they have pythons, like 20 foot pythons, like J-Lo level pythons. Oh my God. Yes, Stop bitch, okay. Stop looking at me, oh my God. Stop, yes. Um, I think so <laughs> absolutely don't piss me off or else you're getting invited to Florida. So pretty much we would um, kill our victims with turning them into animals feasting uh, situation and then into fucking shit. Yeah. 
they would just fucking poop them. Cheers to that bitch. Oh, cheers to poop. We know what we're doing. We know yes. what we're doing. We know what we're doing.